I am from Sihau. We are a sports technology company. We are building a sports operating system that includes uh, custom hardware to provide real-time analytics for training. So, what are you guys doing? Tell me what your tech is all about. So we have uh, developed a sensor uh, and also we are integrating vision into a single system. Uh, what we are doing differently is that we have put the sensor in the bat and the ball together. So we are capturing something that has never been captured before in a bat ball sport. And we believe that it's going to be the truest insight into the game, given that the contest is on both sides. It's a reaction based sport. Okay, so you've got sensors in the bat and in the ball. Yes. What are the sensors picking up? Like, what is it for? So the sensors are picking up basically motion parameters as well as uh, deeper insights on biomechanics and things that you need to do to improve. So we do have a coach app and a player app uh, that helps you so sort of bridge the gap between the coach and player and objectify training uh, more, which has been subjective in nature till date. Okay, do you see this as something that you might be selling potentially to like professional cricket teams or for amateurs as well? So right now the product is being used in high performance academies and also in international, with the international cricket teams in the UK, in South Africa, New Zealand, India, Singapore and Australia. We are also seeing a lot of interest from the broadcasting community because this itself is going to enhance the stories for the fan and enrich fan experience. Um, when you um, say it's already being used, so you have customers already? Yes, and we have about uh, 300 plus users using the product right now. Uh, we get, we're getting about 1,000 to 5,000 data points daily on the platform. Yeah. Very interesting. And are you guys, um, um, are you charging people for it yet? Or is this just about, you know, learning information? At so right point? now we are in the pilot phase. We are in beta and uh, we our objective is to increase engagement uh, more and increase the adoption because with any disruption, there is an education element that needs to be there in the market. And we, we have our resources mostly focus on that. Okay. So my, impre my, my fairly limited knowledge of cricket is that the balls wear out really fast. Yes. Um, they're basically leather balls, um, and they get they get very worn out. And they need to be changed quite frequently, even within a game. Yeah. Um, so how are you guys? You know, doesn't that cost a lot for you guys to keep that up, since you're putting sensors into every ball? Uh, so this is the fi fifth iteration of the uh, uh, for the ball, and we have kind of uh, uh, encountered that problem before. This lasts what it's called an innings in a cricket game, and it. It just uh, lasts the entire uh, length of the game. The good thing is that the ball is a consumable, so people are using more and more. That's good for the business. Yeah. Right. There's no way of like trying to replace the sensor within any ball, though. You have to use your special balls. So right now we are making uh, the balls ourselves. Yeah. Because there is no smart ball company in cricket as such. Right. Uh, over due course of time, when we hit scale, we are going to uh, license out this technology and okay. become a platform company. Very interesting. Okay. Best of luck to you. Thank you. Thank you. you.